Well, first of all, I'm not going to engage in that hypothetical because Joe Biden is very much alive and running for re-election. So but you do are. know. Vice President Kamala Harris sidestepped questions about whether she was ready to hop into the executive role if President Joe Biden decided not to run for re-election in 2024. Our democracy is on the line, Bill. And I frankly, in my head do not have time for parlor games when we have a president who is running for re-election. Biden's age has been a source of criticism for both Republicans and Democrats, particularly after the president announced he would seek re-election. At 80, he is the oldest U.S. president in history and would be 86 at the end of his second term in 2028. Several critics have warned if Biden were to decline to run for president again or become incapacitated while in office, Harris would likely be the Democratic nominee or even sitting U.S. president. However, the Biden-Harris ticket is not doing well in the polls and suffering from historic low approval ratings. I'm not a political pundit, so I, I, I'm not going to speak to that. But what I will say is this. When the American people are able to take a close look at election time on their options. I think the choice is going to be clear. Bill, we're going to win. Let me just tell you that. We're going to win. Harris has a net approval rating of minus 16.8%, according to Real Clear Politics. Biden only fares slightly better at minus 13.7%. Real Clear Politics has Trump leading Biden by 0.7 percentage points in a hypothetical 2024 matchup. 